Midwest corn and soybean plants are up and growing, but some look a little bit better than others. The deep green color of these corn plants is noticeable. Brandt's tech agronomist Ed Corrigan says it's because of the addition of sulfur. And when you see these plants display this nice deep color, you can tell they're off and going. And it's all been tied to critical micronutrients. The dark color of green and sulfur is so, so important to that early uh, vigor, plant vigor. Uh, it assists so much with nitrogen metabolization in both crops. It, it has such an important function um, and we're really starting to see where that's making a, a huge difference in the growth pattern on both crops. Ed says right now stay away from using elemental sulfur. It just simply takes too long to work. There's a better way, he says, to improve crop quality. It's all about not just having good looking crops, but also profitable crops. And for every dollar you spend in corn for sulfur, you'll get a $3 return. For every dollar you spend in soybeans, you get a $6 return. It is a huge, huge profitability item for growers to get in that neighborhood of between 10 and 20 pounds of S. And we try to focus on an ammonium sulfate or a sulfate form of, of S that is available to the crop. Ed says the research shows a 12 bushel to the acre response in beans and 10 to 12 in corn. Right now, if you want to green up those yellow and raggedy looking corn fields, it's easy to do. We just add TRIO. TRIO has some sulfur in it, has zinc and manganese, and that's been one of the items that you can just add it to your foliar uh, herbicide program, Roundup being the typical one, uh, but it, it's compatible with a lot of our herbicides post, and we'll, we'll get a really good response. Um, the more yellowed your corn is, the bigger the response to that quarter TRIO, and it should, in a corn plant, take about three to four days with our uh, 80, 70 degree temperatures to put out a new leaf, that new leaf will have that green color. Ed and the other professionals at Brandt will be tracking and reacting to the growing season all year. For more updates from the Brandt Research Farm, check in with Brandt.co during the growing season.